I'm Nate. I'm Heather. And, and this, this is, is Lacey. Lacey. We're, We're going, going to Imperial, Imperial Beach. Okay, so Imperial Beach is the most southwesterly beach city in the United States. It's way down in the corner of California and known as one of the first big wave surf cities in the world. And we got a hotel right across from the beach. Oh my gosh, this was the cutest puppy. She was more excited than Heather planning for a trip. As we started to explore this little beach town, we noticed all the utility boxes were painted with these amazing ocean seas. It was a great reminder of how transformational artwork can be in a city. Okay, now Lacey's ready to sniff this place out. Are those surfboard bicycle racks? No, they're bicycle surf racks. So what's the story with this statue? It's surfers and sandcastles. It's the spirit of Imperial Beach. Don't surfers run over sandcastles? <laughs> Only the bad ones. Lacey says we better not let anyone ride on her back. And she's wondering why the fish is letting her do it. There was art everywhere, even on the ground. Arr, you'll walk ye old plank if you anger Captain Morgan. Oh yeah, this is my kind of store. Did these two ride an iceberg down for the summer? Lacey found the honey pot. Let us know if you remember how to trick the collect call system on these things. I'd say Lacey wants one of everything. Oh, I think she wants more than one. And I want some of that. She's getting really impatient. He's getting her peanut butter dog ice cream. And now she's letting all the other dogs know that there's ice cream in there. Trying to get coffee to go with that ice cream? We came across this little outdoor market. Now you want cookies? We even caught Lacey enjoying the artwork. But after the candy shop, she thought she was allowed in everywhere. Oh, he's gonna stick his head in that. Don't worry, I'm wearing my protective backpack. So this is the Imperial Beach Pier Park. It was really cool. The surf culture was deep here. It was like it was coming up the ground. And then the sun blew us a bubble. This place had me saying cowabunga, dude. Or maybe just cow, I was getting hungry. Oh yeah, this was crazy. There was a warning to stay out of the water due to a sewage spill from Tijuana. Well, I guess it's good no dogs are allowed on the beach. Lacey didn't want to go on their stinking beach anyway. Besides, this town has plenty of parks to choose from. Oh, and the tile here was so pretty. It gets even better at night. We'll show you that. This was kind of cool, however... Let's just say, watch where you sit, or you're going to end up with a very interesting imprint. And 
they had surfboards for benches all over town. Lacey wanted to surf this one all the way back to Japan. And under every surfboard, there was a plaque. Believe it or not, these guys were proud to be called the Slough Surfers. Everywhere we looked, there was something pretty to look at. A lot of the businesses seem to cater to mermaids. Wow, that's the craziest, prettiest mailbox I've ever seen. We had lots of food options within a couple of blocks, so we decided to walk to pick up dinner. And here's where we got our food the first time. And the second. Just to catch you up, when we picked up our takeout order, they only gave us the bread and the salad. We had to go back for the entree. But I actually forgave them because the food was great and I got to see this amazing sunset. And I know it's blurry, but that's the Coronado Bridge. And that's San Diego. Okay, so the restaurant was only a short two blocks from the hotel, and on our way there, we ran into the police, ambulances, something was going on. You can understand why we didn't notice we missed half our order. Not that any of it was gonna slow Heather down getting back to the hotel. Well, I thought my dinner was getting cold. I didn't know they forgot half of it. Anyway, it didn't seem too serious. After all that commotion, we were rewarded with a puppy that was so new it didn't even have a name. She had just gotten him today from Tijuana. And this is back at the Imperial Beach Beer Park. I told you it was cool at night. The lights and the sound of the ocean made it a great place to just chill out and relax. Lacey says, stop messing around with those lights. Let's go see what kind of nightlife this town has. She met Rudy, but Lacey looks like she's the rude one here. These dolphins look like they rode a rogue wave all the way in. And Lacey wants to surf that wave with them. Oh, watch Lacey work this guy over. First, she lures his dog outside. And when the owner comes out looking for his dog, she says, look at how cute I am. Don't you want to pet me? And one look says it all. Don't you have a treat in there for me? Once she gave him those puppy dog eyes, he had no chance. Don't feel bad, guy. I'm worked over by this cute thing every day. And then we ran into these ladies, and they were having some serious fun. Oh, that was such a fun night. We woke up the next morning and decided to go for a walk. And we stopped off to watch the surfers for a minute. I guess they didn't read the signs about the water quality. Oh yeah, that's scary. This guy rode this way forever. This guy, not so long. Oh. Wipe out. Hi, Chano. Are you having a good morning? You're so pretty. Was that bird flirting with you? I think we interrupted his nice morning listening to this ocean. Well, let's keep moving. I'm trying to get to Mexico this morning. <laughs> wait, wait, I hope you're joking, right? Why, they said it was just down the road. 
Lacey, will you ask for some directions around here, please? Yay, we made it to Tijuana. Nope, no, we didn't. But isn't Mexico right there? You mean across the giant protected wetlands? I don't know, Lacey and I think it looks pretty close. <laughs> no, even Lacey can see it's not that close. Here, just take a look at the map. Well, okay, fine. If no one wants to walk another five, 10 miles, whatever it takes to get to Mexico. We can head back. Okay, but first, Lacey has to get past the neighborhood watch. Yeah, that dolly really didn't want to let her by. Pardon us, dolly. It was such a sweet little beach town. Now this is some art that you really have to walk around to appreciate. <laughs> it looks like they forgot the F. No, they didn't. See, Lacey thinks it's funny. I don't think so. All the people and all the dogs were so friendly. Last chance for a drink. I think she's looking for breakfast. Try some yoga in the park? Namaste. Not today. We came across this building that's about to be torn down. You can see the picture of the new building they're going to build in its spot. Does that make this a historical documentary? Hey, I guess so. Thanks, Thanks for, for going, going to Imperial, Imperial Beach, Beach with us. us.